are like magicians and it is like magic. When we get on this computer and we use our software and we're plugging in all this different data from all these different locations, the fact that we can basically take this, it's like mixing all these different potions and you're putting it all together and then voila, you have this beautiful picture that can give so much people so much information. GIS stands for Geographic Information Systems. Where? Like where is something? So where is a greenway that's close to my house? Where are the water lines that run into this neighborhood? One of our website's most popular maps that the GIS team works on is the interactive development map. This map shows proposed developments that are in review and may be approved or denied by the town. It also shows developments that have been approved and those that are under construction. A lot of people in our community are interested in knowing what could be coming to town, and this map is a wonderful resource for residents helping everyone stay informed. When they were talking about figuring out where to put a new fire station, for insurance reasons, when you have a fire station, you have to be able to respond to certain locations within a certain amount of time. We had to literally plot on a map where we might want a fire station and then look for the area that it covered to make sure that we are meeting those times. If the map is not accurate, then their decisions are not gonna be to the best knowledge that they have. For example, like it needs to be accurate because if there's a water main break, we need to be able to know what water infrastructure is in the area and be able to narrow it down. Because if we don't know where our own stuff is, then it becomes even more difficult to solve problems and fix things that are broken. So as the town of Holly Springs has grown, so has the demand for GIS. When I get to see something that I've made being used by other people, if it's a web map that I've put together and it's put on the website and like the residents get to use it, that's, that's the most exciting part to me. And sometimes you even amaze yourself of the stuff that you can come up with or a map that you created and you're like you're just so proud of it and you're like oh my god I did that this is so exciting yeah. GIS has actually been around for quite a long time people realize the power of it and so now everybody's kind of like asking for GIS solutions to stuff to be successful in GIS you need to be able to to have attention to detail. We are a jack of all trades, but master of none. We do do a little IT, we do a little programming, we do a little bit of graphic design. We do a little, an, uh, like a data analyst, we do database administration, we just, we do it all. It's not just one thing we concentrate on every day. 